Now we've told you how much we love senior woodworking projects, right? Now we've got a cool new thing we gotta show you. Hey Woodworkers on YouTube, it's great to see you again. My name is Mark, I'm from Woodworker Source. Today's question, what's on the bench? Not only what's going on on my bench, but also what's going on on yours, and we're gonna get to that in just a sec. But let me give you a quick tour about what's going on in my shop. So I've got these curly maple panels being glued up. This is going to go into a jewelry box. My oldest daughter's going on that. I've got some Sapelli panels here. A little later in this month, we're going to do another video about how to finish Sapelli. That's coming up. Then over here, I've got a shelf being glued up. So it's out of hard maple for the laundry room. Another thing my daughter wants is a table for her room. And so we had this basically a walnut cookie, a log slice, and we're gonna turn that into a little table for her room. And then, hey, check this out. And I bought some hatchet heads. Here, let's check this out. Yeah, there we go. I wanted to try my hand at carving my own hatchet handle. We had one of our employees made one out of Grenadillo. It looked incredible. So I said, dude, I wanna try that. So. That's what this is all about. When I'm all done with these projects, I'm gonna share a picture of them at our new online woodworking project gallery. And that's the point of this video, just to let you know that this thing exists and that you can come there too and browse projects either for inspiration and ideas or upload and share project pictures of things that you've made too. And we'd love to see what you've made. So let me show you real quick what this thing's all about, how it works and what you can do there. Just go to woodworkersource.com and just navigate your way to the project gallery. So when you first pop in here, naturally you're gonna be greeted with the most recent projects that have been added to the gallery. You can hit the browse menu and there you can locate by project type, techniques used in the project or woods used. So let's check out some turnings and go see what we find, right? I like the look of this turned canister, so I'm gonna check that out. So every project can have up to eight photos on it. So this is kind of cool. You can have multiple angles, you can get detail shots, you can show behind the scenes or even some build process pictures all that kind of stuff. Of course, down below, you got, your you got your description area. We ask you what the finishes that you use on your project. We find that to be a pretty important thing to share. And then you have these tags that apply to the project. For example, if I wanna find more projects that are made out of bloodwood, I can do that. At the moment, we got a couple more projects that are made out of bloodwood, kind of like this guitar. Got a handful of photos, got the front, got the back, got a close-up of the neck, it's just fantastic. This one goes in the musical instrument category. It's made out of ash, bloodwood, ebony, purple heart, wenge. And this guy used band sawing, inlay, lamination, and sculpting, for example, as some of the techniques that went into that project. And I can rabbit hole some more, man. If I want to check out some sculpted projects, I can do that. Just hit that and let's go check out what's in there. So that's the gist and how you might use this gallery for locating a little bit of inspiration, getting some project ideas, or just seeing what other people are making. So now why don't we upload a project and see what that's like, okay? So we hope this part's pretty obvious. All you gotta do is hit the Upload Project button at the top of the screen, and that'll launch you right into the process. As with all things these days, we're gonna ask you to either log in or create an account so that you can log in. It's just the way it works these days. We've seeded this list already with a Ton of wood names. So if you don't see the wood that you used in this list, just let us know and we'll add it. So a link to the project plans. This is totally optional, but if you got project plans from some web article out there, if you got it from a blog, if you even used a, a YouTube video, we ask that you just go ahead and link that here so other people can know where else to get those plans. Okay, success, we got our project up. So at this point, you can also make some edits to some of these photos too. If you need to do some cropping, if you need to do some rotating, little color fixes, you just hit the edit button, go in there, do whatever it is that you need to do to that. So that's now live in the gallery for anyone to go check out, flip through the pictures, check it out, make a comment if they wish, whatever. So that's what I hope you do with this gallery too. Go post some project pictures, get various angles, get some detail shots, use behind the scenes shots if you've got them. We would just love to see what you're making. And on that note, you're gonna run into some projects in this new gallery that say posted by legacy user and you might go, hey, that project is mine. It might be true. If that's the case, we just need you to register an account, log in, and then we'll just move that project over to your account and it's all yours, okay? 
Hey, once again, my name is Mark from Woodworker Source. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. See you next time.